what's up I am back in this video I'm going to show you how to use the JavaFX toggle button so the toggle button in JavaFX is a two-state button control the two states are the selected and unselected property the selected property is true when it is in the selected state otherwise it is false so in this tutorial I'm going to show you in how to create the toggle button in JavaFX and show you how it works so let's get started so here I am going to create the V box as my root root layout and close new V box import the layout and create the scene graph So I'm going to pass in the root object here and declare the scene size to 400 by 400. And I'm going to import the JavaFX scene class and set our scene to the stage. So I'm going to call the stage that set scene and pass in the scene object and stage that set title this would be understanding the toggle button and stage that show all right and what i'm going to do next is to create the toggle button toggle button and name the object to db and assign an initial text here for turn off or turn on and let's import the toggle button class so next is to add the toggle button to our layout so i'm going to call the root that get children that add node db and that's it so let's try to run our program okay as you can see our toggle button is in the left corner so i'm going to assign this to to align this to the center so i'm going to type in the root again and set the alignment to position that center and let's add another label here another node as label and I'm going to name this as the toggle button is selected and import the JavaFX scene control label I'm going to name this as unselected and let's add the label here and add all all right so here i'm going to declare a, an app statement to determine if the toggle button is selected or unselected so if if the toggle button is selected we will change the label to the toggle button is selected and change the 
toggle button text to turn off db that set turn off the same as oops else when it is false right so I think that's it and let's try to run our program so as you can see the toggle button is unselected and it is torn on and yeah if we are going to change the toggle button to selected we can do this tb that set selected to true and let's run that again to see what that look like here the toggle button is selected and it is turned off and let's try to add an action event for our toggle button if we click the toggle button the label and the text is going to change the uh, the, to change the I mean to change the text text so TB that set on action event and use the lambda expression to make the action event and I'm going to copy this code right here and indention set the indention and I'm going to comment this code here and see what this look like and let's run the program okay the toggle button is unselected so let's try to click the toggle button the toggle button is selected turn off all right so let's when we are hovering the toggle button let's try to change the cursor cursor and let's add another event here db that set on mouse entered db that set cursor to hand and run the program again all right when we are hovering our toggle button the cursor will change to hand cursor and click the toggle button all right so that's it and i hope you learned something new in this tutorial please don't forget to like subscribe comment and share and i will see you in the next video